feel glueless. Don't move that. Hold up. Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by I See Hair. They sent me this unit to try for you guys. Now, if you're looking for a beginner friendly curly wig, this one right here may be your girl. This joint is pre cut and pre plucked, blendable lace and removable combs. And to top it all off, she glueless. Glueless. Let me not mess up my hairline. So, if you're looking for an everyday human hair pop on wig, Keep on watching. As always, before I get into the install, the specs, and what I think about this unit straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from IC Hair. All the specs of my unit are right here on the screen, so if you wanna check it out, you can. This is a pre-cut, pre-plucked nine by six, I think, closure wig. It does come with the C-shaped ear tabs. Thank you. <laughs> Why C-shaped design? Inspired by Kai. Thank you, IC Hair, for definitely shouting your girl out. I don't wear these glasses for fun, I gotta see. As well as the removable comb, so if you wanna take your combs out of your wig, you can definitely do that. I love that feature for IC Hair. They really stepped up the cap constructions for closure wigs. And you know, I'm here for it, especially for the glueless looks. And that's the plan that I have today, to rock her glueless. And I think I'm gonna do a side part. Do I wanna use the combs on the side? No, I don't. So let me go ahead and take those out. I just love that feature, I really do. It does have the wear go band already in it, but the ones they send you are black. I did go ahead and wash my wig. However, the chemical smell in this unit is still in there. So I will be spraying mine down with my hair freshener. But before I do, let me tint my lace with my makeup powder. This is my Black Radiant Soft Focus Powder in the color Milk Chocolate. And I'm gonna take that all around the hairline. I may have to cut some of this lace back just because it may blend down a little wonky in some areas. Now, if you don't have the hair freshener, you can get it from my Amazon storefront, or you can just go ahead and wash your wig and then pop her outside. Let the breeze get through the strands, okay? I promise you it will help. Trust me, I have done it. <laughs> but today I'm gonna use my ISO Plus hair freshener. This is the African Wildflower scent. Get up under there too. One of my wig bays, Yolanda, put me onto that in my local beauty supply store. So every time I use those in my head, I'd be like, thank you. <laughs> I really appreciate it, because these wigs be stained. Let's get this down. That nine by six is looking pretty decent. It's definitely giving snug, but comfortable. It is a little short on my side. However, the ear tab function is still working for me. So big here, girls, it's pretty much a perfect fit. So if you are 23 and below, you good to go. 23 and above, try another one, love. <laughs> I don't think they sent me clips. For my hairline, I'm gonna bring down my sides a little bit over here, just to make sure it's gonna sit and camouflage my sides. So I'm gonna use my Nairobi mousse to do that, as always. Again, a glueless look is a molded look. It does not stick, all right, because it's not glue, it's a mousse. Some of y'all be asking me why your wig is lifting, because it's a mold. Glueless does work better for the closure units because you don't have a lot of lace flapping around your ear taps. Let me put my glasses back on. How cute is that? Let me get these little hairs out of my face. It's gonna take my band and it's gonna put it around, nope, oh, right here. Now, Roby Mousse. I'm gonna put it all over the hair. This should be a very easy install. If you are a beginner wig bay, water wave texture is a nice segue into curly wigs. Y'all see how easy this is? I don't have to go in and, and detangle any of the hair because it already kind of clumps by itself just by me doing this. I am getting some shedding right now and I did get some shedding when I did the co-wash. Put the mousse all over and just work it through with my fingers. Will it coil if I finger curl it? It will. Just, you know, on my ends, make sure you finger coil the root. Get some lift. I'm gonna clip up the hair right here in the front. I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup. We will come back and diffuse the hair and fluff it. Let's take off my band and see how my hairline is sitting. Ooh, very pretty. Don't gotta do too much. Why is it so hard? Let's brush back what I don't need. Let me show y'all the side really quick. My sides are out right here. I feel it pulling. Is it pulling or is just my hairline lifting up? Use a little bit of my contour shade. Nothing crazy, because the lace blended down pretty nicely. Y'all, when I say beginner friendly, I mean that. Let me just pull some of the hair like this. Kind of liven it up for my taste. I like it to be a little bit more lived in. Take my clips off. 
bring the hair to the front. I'm gonna use the Black Radiant Soft Focus Powder in the color Creamy Bronze. Just bring that down. Are we done? Wait a minute. <laughs> the middle part, you know, that could be cute. Or I could do like a little flip over situation and pull a little Nairobi right here. I've been doing so many middle parts, kind of change it up a bit. Just fixing my hairline, getting my part in space together. Let's clip it again. I know y'all like, girl, you were done. I know. Hold up, I got a little bit extra for here, right here. There we go. Moving the part in space will change up the shadows on your wig, so you may need to go back in and touch up your lace like I am doing. And I'm just gonna fluff out the hair with my fingers. Make sure it's the shape that I want. And I think that is it. This one just may be my go-to because this was easy. If you are looking for a beginner friendly curly wig that doesn't take a lot of effort, this one right here for sure it took more effort to do the side part than it did to put it on how it was out the pack the hairline is looking real nice still glueless mm-hmm still glueless don't move that hold up i have no complaints about this wig whatsoever me and this wig are looking good as a unit i like that you don't gotta call daddy papa for this one either okay because the price point is real nice i'm pretty sure it's like 150 but i think i have a coupon but i don't have much else to say because you know the streets gotta see me <laughs> So that's all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to Icy Hair for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. I will put the direct link, my specs, and any coupon codes I have for this unit down below. So if you guys want to check it out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.